Hello, Rockers and Mercuryans. Rock Mercury here. Welcome to the Rock Mercury Podcast. Today we have a very special day. We are going to be opening up this jackfruit. We have a jackfruit right here. It is a fresh jackfruit. If you guys know, some stores are blessed enough to have these. These are very pricey, very luxurious. Um, So I'm going to open this up. Is definitely ripe and I feel that it's soft on this part because you definitely want it to be a little soft. Um, I found a way to open them because they're very challenging to open. They have spikes on the skin. You can see all the spikes on there. Um, it is it's a little challenging, but we're going to see if this new way I learned on YouTube works out. So first, I'm going to take this this off of here. Um, the rubber band with the jackfruit. The marvelous jackfruit. The marvelous jackfruit. That's how it's supposed to look on the inside. The marvelous jackfruit. Okay, so I have my knife here. It's all ready. And be careful, you guys, if you're cutting with this. Like, you want to be safe, of course. But the first thing they said to do is, and there's latex in this, so you guys want to be careful with the latex on this, too. First thing you want to do is cut around the, the um, cut around the, like, the stem. You want to cut around the stem first. That's what it said online. So you made a full circle around the stem part. So I did that. Now I'm going to lay it down again. I'm going to lay this down. Um, you want to use a knife that you don't care about too much. Because you definitely, um, they def you definitely don't want to have, I mean, you definitely don't want it to be like, to, spew everywhere kind of thing like you don't want the latex latex in it and it could ruin your knife you want to use like a like a decent knife that's not something that you really care about too much and you want to cut straight down the middle of it straight down the middle all right so that's supposed to be it right there and then you like make a little space there and the rest of it is peeling the rest of it is supposed to be peeling, you guys. So I'm gonna try to see if I can peel it open. It might get a little messy, but that's what you're supposed to do that. You're supposed to be able to peel it. Ugh, this is not working as easy as it showed online. It never really does work as easy, does it? Also, the one online was a little bit smaller, but they worked it and worked it. Let's see. Ugh. Because the way he did it, it showed the whole core at the end. Ooh, maybe I can get from this edge here. Maybe I can try to get it peeled from the edge. You guys see that? Um. Oh, all right. <laughs> it's not really working as planned exactly, but it's kind of coming off. I have one piece here. Here's some jackfruit there. So we got one piece already. That's that's pretty satisfying to get at least a piece in. Mm, let me mm. Tastes great. Tastes so good. Y'all see these latex pieces here? These hold all the pods. You basically house the pod. That's one, but it looks like it's not. That one's like kind of white, so I don't want to eat that one. It's not as um as vibrant orange as I like. I like it. And so, um, let's skip that one. But you see these. Some of them look like mushrooms. How they're, like, like they're holding it, all the plant together. All the, um, the pods together. Let's see. What does it taste like? It tastes like, um, what would I explain this taste like? Um, it tastes like... Like sweet in a way, like sweet, but I really don't know. I don't know what to explain it. Like it's 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 kind of sweet, but it has like a nice texture to it. It's not mushy at all. This one doesn't have any pods. Oh, here's a pod here. Here is perfect. I'm glad we got a full pod here that I can show you. Cause this pod has a seed in it. Each of them have a seed. You see right here. Here is the seed. Ooh, beautiful. I got this from H E B. The grocery store, the neighborhood grocery store here in Texas. So I got an H E B um, jackfruit. These are the seeds here. I guess you can grow 
You can grow some stuff with it. I'm gonna look up, I'm gonna save the seeds in a separate section so that, cause I heard that people can make like meat with the seeds. You can like grind it up or do something with it. I don't know. But the texture is perfect. The texture is really great. Do you ever cook with it as a meat substitute? Substitute, you can. And I prefer to use a ripened one than a, um, a ripened one than a, what do you call it? Like a, a canned version of it. You don't want that canned stuff. You see how it's really soft textured? It's, it's a beautiful taste. If you if you tried the canned version, I think you should try the real version too. Thanks, never seen one. It's very good. The original flavor of juicy fruit gum by Whitley's. Ooh, yeah, it tastes like juicy fruit gum. It definitely tastes like juicy fruit gum. Yeah, that's it. Mm. Someone said, do you eat mango? Mango's good, yeah. I like mango a lot, if you can find a good one. Y'all, yeah. when it's ripe, the more ripe it is, the easier it will come apart. But um, this is not happening like it did on the video, for sure. This is not at all happening like that. But I'm just gonna cut section, I'm just gonna open it section by section and see how much I can get off of here. Cause this whole core part is supposed to come out of here, but I can't really open it like that. It's so big. It's so big. And these latex pieces are um, super, super strong. I'm keeping hydrated. You told me to be doing so. That's right. Um, Michelle, my bell, says, oh, I wouldn't like it since I don't like juicy food. Oh, well, you might not like this flavor, but it's really good. Very, really, really good. It looks like the core is kind of brown, but it's still all, all the fruit's good, so... Um. Hmm. It's not how I plan a video, the video to go. I guess I could like just try to pull some of these latex things off of here as I'm opening it up. There we go. I'm getting some leeway with it. Another chunk on. <laughs> um, is that the fruit that tastes like meat? Um, yeah, it can if you season it right. Um, just CC says, are you going to plant the seeds? I don't really know. Um, someone said, boil the seeds. So delicious. Okay, maybe I'll try that. I never had that before. Izzy Chavella says, what is that? It's a jackfruit. Kevin Schofield says, rock. Rock, what is your skincare routine? Because you're growing. I know why. Because of Jesus Christ. Oh my God. <laughs> it's shea butter. Shea butter. Um, see, she, the foreign, says, I don't know why this looks like chicken to me. <laughs> that's like, this looks like chicken. That's hilarious. Um, Rock, what's up? How you doing? How you doing? Right, we're going to keep on getting into this, y'all. Since I'm making some more leeway, I'm just going to eat as I go. Because I thought I was going to have a really pretty core for you guys with all the the pods, because it's like this pod around the whole, the whole core. So it's like really pretty like that, you know? Um, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and take these seeds. I'm gonna boil the seeds this time, you guys. Like, yes, tell me to boil the seeds. So I'm just gonna keep them off to the side right here and boil them afterwards. But that delicious, delicious fruit. I really suggest if you see one, it costs a bit. This is like $15 for this, but I think it's totally worth it. Very good. Mm-hmm. Very good. What's it taste like though? It's um, like Wrigley gum, or the real version. Mm, yeah, it's very tasty. So, um, I'm just gonna pull sections off. This is the best way for me. But if you're trying to prepare it, you might want to maybe cut it all the way through because the way they said of like peeling it all apart and making the core, it, it did not work for me. I would love to try it. It's very good. Y'all should try it. Is that soursop? No, soursop is very small. Um, Kevin Schofield says, Road to 1 million rock by the end of 2022. Oh, thank you. That's amazing. Um, Just Grimm says, They say it tastes like, tastes rotten. No, it tastes, doesn't taste rotten at all. 
It's a sweet, um, it has a little sweetness to it. It definitely has a little sweetness. Um, Crash says, what is that? It's, it's um, no, it's not durian. Oh my God, this is jackfruit. Uh, you will not see me eating durian. Durian is illegal in some places because it smells so rotten. But this is jackfruit and it's, it's, um, it has a very sweet, like strong texture. Like it's not, it's not like mushy. Like there's a little bite to it, you know? Mm-hmm. Hello, Holly Joe. Good to see you. Rich over says, good morning, Rock. I hope you're doing so much, um, doing well. Much love, much love to you. Good morning, Holly Joe. Harlem Bourne says, so it's the latex that makes the, um, people itch. Mm. Possibly so. I'm not sure. It depends on if you're allergic. Doesn't that stink? No, it doesn't stink. Um, or is that another food? It might, I mean, I'm not sure. Some people, I mean, you know, some people are allergic to certain things, so I don't really know for sure. All I know is that I love me some jackfruit. But this one I may have let sit for a little longer for the top part. Because it looks like the top is starting to go out. But it's so good. What does it taste like? I already said what it tastes like. Um, Risky Walter says, I feel a lot of people are allergic to that fruit. Um, I don't think a lot of people, this is, it's a very mild flavor, you guys. It's a very mild flavor. Let me turn these comments so I can see them better. Um, that fruit stinks. No, this fruit, it doesn't smell like, it smells really good, actually. It smells like a nice, it's a nice, like, floral kind of smell. It doesn't stink. This one, like, papaya does stink. I think it smells awful. Mm. Well, maybe you're not tropical. <laughs> Smells great to me. I think you're mistaking it for durian. Yeah, you're de you're definitely mistaken for durian. I think that person is. Well, um, I thought I was gonna give you guys an easier way to open it, but I did not do that. <laughs> Where'd you get it then? I got it from the grocery store at H E B. Back home, we usually cook those first. Tastes way better. Tastes great raw. Are you James Harden? No, I'm not James Harden. Um. Hug says, oh, maybe, thanks. Yeah, that's probably what you're thinking of. Because um, durian and jackfruit look the same outside. Do they really? Does durian and jackfruit look the same? I've seen them, but I don't think they look exactly the same. I think they look very different. How long How long do you wash that? I don't. I didn't wash it. You just open it up. The inside is already clean. Ooh, it's, like, so hard to open, you guys. Like... I really thought this was going to be easier with the way that they told me online. Uh, okay. I'm just going through here, grabbing out the fruit I can. Um, my helper in Dubai used to curry it, and she loves it. Ooh, curry. That sounds really good. Curry jackfruit. Um, how do you eat? How do you eat it? I'm just taking the pods out. I'm taking the seed. The seeds inside. I pull the seed out. I'm gonna do another video where I boil the seeds once I look on YouTube and see what the best way to do that is. Um, but yeah, I'm really just pulling it off, taking the little latex off of there, and here we go. How much is durian fruit in Texas, Rock? Because here in New York, everything is super expensive. I don't. I never bought durian fruit. I don't plan on ever buying it. Um. I don't know what to tell you. I never, I never, I never even seen it before here. Mm. What parts do you eat? You eat the fruit part and the seeds if you boil them. Apparently, you can eat the seeds. So I'm gonna try that too. You have to cut it open. Cut open. Cut tin open with your hand. What in the world? Um. Amy Chunk says hi from, from Texas. Hey, 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 I'm in Texas too. Real Capri says, you ate jerk chicken before? Um, Back in the day, before I was vegan. What does it taste like? It tastes like, um, like wrigley fruit, crumb, but like healthy. What are we eating this morning? We're eating jackfruit. Jackfruit is so hard to find in stores. Yeah, it is. 
When I went to the store, there was only one there. And then when I went again, there was only one there again. They only stock like one at a time. For some reason, people don't buy them like that. Is it sweet? Yeah, it's kind of sweet in a good way. Um, what's up from Tennessee? Hey, Tennessee. Um, Law Boy said jackfruit is very delicious. It is so delicious. Dino Girl says I'm in San Antonio, a few hours away. Oh yes, you just San Antonio life. Um, let's see. What's your last? What was your last meal meal? Um, I only had a, I had like a smoothie yesterday. I was very upset with the situation that happened to me at the gym, and I had to call the police. And so I just was not really that hungry after dealing with the police and stuff, um, the sheriff department. So I kind of didn't eat anything last night. Just had like that French toast you guys saw me eat. Um, barbecue jackfruit is amazing. Yeah, very good. Pineapple and juicy fruit bubble gum. Yeah, that's kind of what it tastes like. Um, bro's been chewing for an hour. What are you talking about, Turtle Hunter? Don't get blocked. Blaze and Dave says, hey, Sunshine, showing you some love from Katy, Texas. Hey, Katy. And Katie, Texas is great. Brianna Sass says, do you find it um, in a produce store? Because I definitely don't see them in regular grocery stores. Yeah, they have, they're in special stores. Like, they're in, like, very nice, um, very nice grocery stores. Bob Boy says, it's very sticky, though. Yeah, it's very sticky. Um, Perma Duke says, you should take a knife and open the fruit, not open it with your hands. I did already use a knife, if you saw me. Um, that's how I got this opened. Um... But on, on YouTube, it showed that you can cut it with a knife and then start peeling it open. That's what I was trying to do. Um, OMG, what happened? Um, you know, some, somebody um, threatened me and they tried to attack me at the gym. I think I'm going to cancel my gym membership, you guys. I think I'm going to cancel it and just, like, do everything at home. I already do yoga, so it's like I don't need to go to that gym anymore. I don't like how they're handling the situation. Um, so I'm not, I'm not sure. Why call? Why you call? Why age? in the world? You mean the your police? Um, Kevin Schofield says, "What happened, Rock? You don't have to answer if you're not comfortable." Yeah, I have to call the police on someone because they tried. They threatened me at the gym. Um, I think they were jealous of me and and they were closeted or something. I don't know. It was crazy, crazy people. Probably a stalker. Did they attack you out of nowhere? Yeah, out of nowhere. I don't even know that person. Um, how did this smell? It smells delicious to me. This smells really good. That's a jackfruit. That's thank you fruit of durian. Yeah, that's a, that's a thank you one, y'all. It's durian. Um, here at my grocery store, they sell it. Oh, great. You're lucky. Um, El Morado. El Morado said, don't work out at home. Go to a new gym, bro. No, I, I mean, I, I live in a mansion, so I have plenty of space to work out at home. But I'm just, I think I'm just going to do that. Um, thank you for the heart love, Tina, Fe Tina Fina. I appreciate you. Um, and I'll probably live stream my workout. Only thing I miss is the steam room and the sauna, but it's okay. I don't really need it that much. Um, let's see. Here at my grocery store, they saw it. Yeah, because you know, people are just getting weirder and weirder. They're like losing their minds. This man came out of nowhere. I'm like, I don't want to deal with people like that. So I'm just going to probably cancel my membership starting next this next month. Um, usually it takes like a month to cancel, but like I'm telling them that I'm gonna call, I'm calling a lawyer. Like this is I feel like I had a hate crime. It felt like really felt like a hate crime, you guys. So I'm thinking I'm gonna go I'm gonna go on today, talk to the manager, and tell them hey, until you guys ban this person, I'm not coming to your gym again. Um, what does it taste like though? Mm, like juicy fruit. Yeah, what does it smell like? It smells like very very like it feels like just i don't like a tropical fruit it's hard kind of hard to put a, a finger on the smell um why were they trying to attack you because i was changing in the locker room and they were jealous it was really bizarre I, like i've never even met this person before but i did a story time yesterday so i'll post that video it's already on youtube but i'll post it on here today too um Angel says, I'm sorry that happened to you. You seem like such a nice person. Yeah, I wasn't even bothering this person. I never said a word to this person before they started coming at me. And they started accusing me of all kinds of things that just are not true. I'm like, are you serious? This is insane. Um, I would be jealous if Jesus Christ, too, it was probably a deranged fan. He Honestly, he probably was a deranged fan, to be honest. What was it he was? Was it a guy? Yeah, it was in a men's locker room. It was a guy. Jackfruit or dragon... Or dragon fruit. <laughs> this dragon fruit is like tiny. This is a big old jackfruit. Mm -mm. Not dragon fruit. 
Yeah, y'all. I'm just going to keep on pulling out this. I'm pull pulling out these pods through the latex. Um, were you scared? I'm sorry that happened to you. Um, No, I got real gangster. I got real gangster real quick. I cussed him the heck out because I'm like, who the heck are you talking to? Like, like who are you? But then I was like, you know what? He's trying to fight me. So I'm like, you know what? Let me call the security. I got security there. And then I was like, you know what? This isn't enough. Let me call the sheriff department because you need to be told. And it turns out this guy works for the feds. So I'm like, you work for the feds? Are you talking to me this way? You think you can get away with this? Nah. So I'm pressing the the um, the gym to ban him. I mean, if they don't ban him, I'm just gonna be gone. Like they would hear what Like they saw, they found him at the um, at the. They found him like when I went when I went to the gym again with the sheriff's department. He was there, and so they talked to him directly, and he lied to them. Wrong. He made it seem as if I was trying to aggress him too. I'm like, why would I try to aggress you? When I'm asking the people who work there to call security on you. What does that look like? You know, you want to fight? You want to fight? You want to fight? Yeah, let's fight. Let's fight. Secu call, hey, call security. Call security. Hey, call security. Like, what? Who does that? Mm -hmm. I went straight to calling security. I'm like, are you serious? I'm like, who are you person? Who is this deranged person? Like, why do you want to fight me? Jealousy is evil. Hold on, let me bring this in a close touch more. Um, what do you skip? Sorry, May, um, Madison says what? I don't know what that means. Brianna says, is it the same? Hold on, you guys. I missed a comment. Um, is it the same? No, it's not the same. Not at all. Jack, <laughs> Jack and fruit is so different than jackfruit. Mm, very different. One's like more water based. Mariah Exotic says, Hello, everyone. Hello. Pretty April, April says, I work out at home too. Honestly, it's better to just be in your own space and work out. Yeah. Especially when you have space and, you know, I live in a beautiful neighborhood, very safe neighborhood. Um, so, it's all great. Amy Chunk says, There's, um, they're $5. With five dollars, the jackfruit. Sorry, not, I mean the um, dragon fruit. Dragon fruit is five dollars, but this jackfruit is fifteen dollars. You know they are they are very pricey. They're eighty eight cents a pound, and they weigh a lot. <laughs> they weigh quite a bit. I'm gonna pick it up again so y'all can see how much it weighs. So it's giant. Look at my head. It's literally bigger than my head. Literally bigger than my head. Um, J Law Boy says he's jealous of you. Yeah, he definitely was jealous. Most definitely. It was sad. I was like, oh, poor baby. So jealous. Why are you so jealous, baby? I'm gonna start putting all these other pieces into the separate bag so it's easier to throw away. It's delicious. This jackfruit is amazing. I haven't had it in a while because it is $15. So I was like, you have to really. Want to do the work, <laughs> and you have to find it first of all. Want to do the work, and then want to pay fifteen bucks for one fruit. But it's, it's worth it to me. I don't think I don't think that's that much money. Jack's boy says he's jealous of you. Oh, I said that already. Um, Brianna says those are probably the only two fruits I'm scared to try. It's delicious. Burger boy says um, love face. Thank you. Malama says you actually live in a mansion. Yes, I do. Um, Bop to dop. The Bop the Top says, was he screaming derogatory terms at you? Yes, he literally was screaming derogatory terms at me. He was accusing me of things that I was like, I, was like, Are you, I can't even say the words on here because it's TikTok. He was accusing me of this craziness. I'm like, who are you? Like, you just met me. I've never seen you before. He definitely was a fan. He most definitely was like, he knows my work for sure. Like, there's no way that he can just come at me from nowhere like that. Like, it was so crazy, y'all. It was so bizarre. So, so bizarre. And I was just like, this person is losing their mind. And I don't want to be around people like this. Another pod. Let me get that seed out of there. I'm excited to boil these seeds. I'm going to look up the recipe and I'll do a whole nother line. Ooh, probably later on today. Just boil the seeds up and 
um, show you guys what, what they do after. Because I know that some of the package meat you guys have, like when you get the jack, the jackfruit, that's like the barbecue jackfruit packet, they said they use those seeds. So I'm curious to see what it's like. I don't think they use the fruit part, but the fruit is delicious. Ah. Mm, I love it. I love it. Look, y'all. You start to see the, you start to see the core. There's the core right here, and the fruit pods on the side, all the way down. There probably was a fan who was a psycho. Yeah. Yep, it's jackfruit. Mm -hmm. Island boy now nail says, "Where do you get that jackfruit from?" Um, from the from H E B grocery store. Thankfully, they had it. They're, they're amazing. I love H E B so much. Um, Brianna says it's a chicken salad. Lol, it's not a chicken salad. You better stop. <laughs> Tina Fina says you should do ASMR. Um, I kind of already do that. You know, like my this is my version of it. Like I'm not gonna go get the. I have the microphone already, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna like do those kind of videos. Um, I know some people get a lot of money from them, but that's just not my thing. I like watching them, but I don't like doing them. Because it just takes a lot of work. Um, I don't know. I just, uh, I don't know, you guys. It's just really not for me. I could do it on live. On, like, if I did it on YouTube live and put my mic out and just was, like, did the whole tingles thing and all that. Like, I could. But it's, like, I don't, I like talking to you guys. I like keeping it really real and live. Like, I feel like ASMR is very performative. Nothing wrong with it. I do watch it myself. I do watch people do ASMR. I don't watch it as often as I used to. But I do watch it, and I just feel like it would become performative for me. So I'd rather just do what I'm doing. Ch chatting with you guys, eating. Um, keeping it real. That's my vibe. That's my vibe, baby. Mm-hmm. Look at that latex on there. I wish there was something you could do with the latex. But at least, at least I didn't destroy my knife this time. Sometimes when you cut it too much, your knife gets all the latex over it. It does not come off. Um, Euphara says, hey, Rock, good to see you today. Good to see you, too. Jawboy says he was jealous of something on your body that he doesn't have. LOL. Well, yeah, he kept talking about my private parts. He just kept discussing. He's like, you got your private parts out. You got this. Da, da, da. I'm like, I just got out the shower. I'm putting my clothes on. I'm putting my oil on. You got to know I put my shea butter on right when you're wet. You got to do it when you're wet. That's the best time to do it. So I'm putting my shea butter on and living my life when this man just decided to come for me, you know? I think he really wanted to come for me, but he he came for me, and it was just, like, really um, disturbing, you know? So, I'm just thankful that it did not escalate to where he was going to actually attack me, but he did threaten me to attack me. He said he was going to beat me up outside, or whatever, you know, all this stuff. It got to the point where I literally called the cops, so. Um, yummy, yeah, so yummy. Brianna says, hey, that's right. He said, I got a real gangster CDFU. That's right. What in the world? Um, Lily Roberta says, what exactly did he say? I can't go into what he said because it was so explicit what he said that I can't say it on TikTok. But it was just, it was disturbing. Um, Kevin Schofield said he was probably racist. He was black too. This man was black as well. And he said he worked for the feds. From... Little did he know, so do I. <laughs> or did I? I don't anymore. Um, but it was crazy. It was so crazy. Crazy tale. But there are, there's, sometimes there is internal racism. Sometimes a person who's your same color can be racist towards you still. Believe it or not, that happens. Um, crazy tale. Selfie says, what fruit is that? This is jackfruit. Um, Blaze and Day says, you need to find out where he works so we can so we can harass him at his job and get him removed. I would love to do that. I would love to do that. The only issue is that the cops would not give me his information, his like his name and stuff. Um, even though I saw him there again, it wouldn't give me his details. It's all on the police report, bro. I gotta figure it out. I'm I'm getting a lawyer to figure this out. This is really messed up. Um. Raven Bearclaw says, OMG, you're so adorable. Thank you. Um, let's see. I'm kind of okay, though, like, with losing, with leaving the gym. I'm just, like, kind of over everything anyway. So, I'm like, uh. 
I'm gonna go to the gym down the street first. Why am I? Cause that, cause you get access to a few different gyms when you pay as much as, much as I pay. Um. So I'm gonna go to this other one. It's down the street. It's not as nice as this one, but I'm gonna go there until just to the month ends. And then I'm gonna be done work it out. Work out at home. I'm good. I'm over this. What did it taste like? Like Rigby gum. Somebody said in pineapple or something. It does kind of have a pineapple taste too, a little bit, or a texture. Um, what is it? Um, you look, you look goofy, says this person. Ooh, wow. If you saw this person's face and the way that they, they're structured and they're calling me looking goofy, wow, the delusion is strong in this one. We're gonna go ahead and block them. Block them out, goodbye. Dylan says, if bro gets buff, he gonna look like carrot Karatos. What does that mean? Buck, um, Buckot says no one cares. Mm. Well, you obviously care enough to be commenting. So you're getting blocked. Goodbye. Um, Tay Nobo says, what are you eating? I'm eating jackfruit. It's so good. Um, Nortali says, what does it taste like? I already answered that. And Raven Bearclaw says, how could anyone hate you? You're so cute. Oh, thank you. Um, Steno Girl says, sounded like male Karen. Mmm. Sound like you're blocked. Um, San Sandria Bar says good morning from Viejo, California. Mm hmm. Good morning to you. Um, Humble Hustler says, bro, what you eating? I'm eating jackfruit. It's so good. Um, Blog Boy said jackfruit is $38 here. Ooh, $38. Oh my gosh. Um, Law Boy says jackfruit is 38 here. I saw that already. Um, Kevin Schofield says, Rock, do you know who K Kane, Kane Kerner is? It, he is a TikToker who eats fruit all the time. And dragon fruit. Oh, whoa. No, I never heard of him before. Um, Curve Galore says, does it, ma does it taste like a lemon orange type of texture? No, not that at all. It's not that kind of wetness. Um, Rude says, how long does it stay fresh for? Um, I really don't know. It depends, depends on when it, when you get it from the tree. I think it just starts immediately, you know, going bad. Not, not going bad, but just like, you just get it, like the time starts when you get it off the tree. <laughs> I think that's how it goes. But like this one I had for like a few days after I bought it from the store, but I don't know when they picked it from the tree. So I'm not sure. Um, Raven Bear Claw says jackfruit beer tacos are yummy. Ooh, okay. I might try that. Um, I like, I want to try with these fresh seeds though. Um, Mir Moritale says, is it, is it sweet? Um, yeah. Texas Babe says, cut it in small particles. Mmm, okay. Um, so good y'all i'm just loving i'm like eating i'm like eating it like this it's really good humble hustler says just ate dragon food and star food both were good but wasn't that sweet how do you know if they're sweet yeah some of those dragon foods and stuff they're very watery like the dragon food itself is so expensive for like no to no flavor i don't buy them anymore i don't even buy them i don't even buy, buy, um, buy those Quiff Math says, you from Colorado? No, I'm not. It was Steno Girl says, sounded like a male Karen. Oh, that's the person I blocked. Maybe I shouldn't have blocked them. Hold on. I'm gonna take a picture of them with my other phone. I'm gonna unblock them. Cause I think they're saying that the person sounded like a male Karen, not me. So I'm just gonna unblock them when I go back and I get off of here. Cause I think I think I misheard what they were saying. I just I have to take a picture of their name so that I know what it is. Um, we can't see. What do you mean we can't see? Um. Let's see. Rock says someone told me yesterday I was a joke, so I said your life is a joke, and then. 
she sh then he shut up. Well, that's a, probably a fact about their life. Um, Humble Hustler says, Kevin Schofield, he's the one that convinced me to try dragon food and star food. Okay. Interesting. It is good. It's just like not, it's like kind of watery for that price. Um, Claudia says durian. No, this is not durian. Mm -mm. No, no, no. Not durian. This is jackfruit. And I'm eating it, picking it all out right now. There we go. Just opening it all up and grubbing on up. During, can you eat the entire thing at once? Uh, I might. I might do that. I might eat the entire thing. Um, and then I'll boil the seeds up, these seeds, and I'll eat that later on. Yeah, I might do that. I'm not really sure. Cause I gotta see what these what the boiled seed recipe is. Would you replant them? No, I'm not gonna replant them. I, I'm in. I live in Texas now, so I don't think they're gonna live out here. I don't know if it's like the right temperatures and mm, it's climate or sunshine. I don't. I don't know. I don't know if it's the right place for jackfruit trees to grow. They take a long time to grow. They take a long, long time. Would you replant? Um, yeah. In a long time to fruit, like years and years and years. What about durian? Mm mm. Let's see. It looks rotten, homie. No, only the top part is kind of soft. But yeah, it, that part sat too long, but the rest of it is tasting perfect. Like, it's really the perfect jackfruit. Um, is jackfruit hood? Is jackfruit hood? What in the world? Um, good. Yes, it is good. I didn't even say good. SVT Rayo says, heard you get back. What do you got, man? Ben, that guy says, I like your hands. Thank you. Heard you get, get guy? What, that, what are you talking about? Kevin Schofield said, that fruit is big AF. It is big. Rude 746 says that, what is the texture of that fruit? Um, that's a bite to it. I don't, I don't, mm, I don't really know. That's, I can't think of like what other fruit is similar to this. I can't think of anything that's like, it's so, so specific, the texture of it. It's, um, it's not mushy. It's definitely a bite to it. Where is the fruit grown? In some tropical place. Maybe it says on the back of here. Mexico. This is growing in Mexico. So, that's where it's at. Medico. That's tropical. Some places in Mexico are tropical. Some places in America are tropical too. Depends on what you consider tropical. Good morning, yo, Abraham. What does Abraham mean? Terrell says, love H-E-B. Me too. H-E-B is amazing. Kevin Schofield says, Rock, you should TikTok battle someone. No, I'm good. I didn't really like that. I'm not a little people person. TikTok battles just seem like very like annoying to me. I tried it, you guys. I'm kind of over it. Um, Don't taste too smoke says, you kind of look like the Liver King. The Liver King wishes he looked this good. He actually looks sickly like he's going to fall over anytime. Um, and I'm sure those steroids are doing a lot to his system. I don't do steroids. Um, Jizzy, Jizzy Kavala says, do you know what bread fruit is? Yeah, I do, but I never had it before. Yo, King Moses. Hello, hello. Um, you have amazing skin that glows amazing. Thank you. He uses shea butter. That's right. Um, McKinley says, glad that... Glad to be in your presence. Oh, you're welcome, my child. Um, Dib Blue Blue says, I love fried breadfruit. Well, you can fry the breadfruit? I didn't know you can do that. Um, how much is the how much of the fruit is edible? Um, only the pods. Only the pods are, and apparently the seeds are. So we're going to have those seeds later on. Not right now, though. Not right now. Right now, I'm still searching through all of this to get to the, um, get the more of these pods in here. 
So I like the work of it. It makes me feel like I'm just working for my food, even though I did not cut this off or do anything to grow this. I feel like I'm working for it. You know, here's another seed. Um, yeah, I feel like this way is like less dirty to clean, to do it this way. Is that good? It's very good. Mm -hmm. Lucky number five says, hello, have you always been plant-based vegan? For 15 years or so. Mm -hmm. Hekka says, you in the Caribbean? No, I'm not in the Caribbean. Mama Hollywood says, Kevin, thank you for telling me. So beautiful. Mm -hmm. um, you have a king look. Oh, thank you. Mark and, Mark and Kelly, Mac and Kelly. Uh, my ex-husband told me I had a king look, but didn't treat me like a peasant. So I appreciate it. So weird how people do that. Oh. McKinley says, you yeah, saw that already. Kiel7 says, living my life. That's right, living my life. Ignore him, yep. Um, Kevin Schofield says, Rock, this is weird, but when I get out of the shower, I hate soft feet and soft hands. Why do you hate soft feet and soft hands? That's like, you, you gotta, you know, moisturize yourself. You gotta be moisturized and, and healthy and stuff, you know? It's important. Ooh, this is like a little rotten in that part. Um, you gotta moisturize. That's the best way. Get in. So this seed right here, ooh, this seed looks a little bit sketch. I'm gonna put that over there, but the actual fruit looks okay. I don't know. Let me see how this. Oh yeah, that seed looks like somehow it got went bad a bit, but the fruit's still pink. So I'm gonna eat it. All pink, but look fresh looking. Drizzle says, "Morning, me lord. Morning, me child." Kevin Schofield says, "I use shea butter. Yeah, shea butter." Mommy Hollywood says. Anyone know where he gets the shea butter from? So many crap ones. Um, go to my website. Go to rockmercury.com. Click on Amazon. I have my own personal Amazon store. Click on Slay Shea, which is a section where I have all the stuff I use for my shea butter when I make it myself. And right now it's live. I, I put it live. You guys can go order it today if you want. I do get a percentage. Very small percentage, but I do get a percentage of what you order from Amazon. It doesn't cost you anything. It just they just pay me for, you know, supporting them. But this is stuff I really buy. I get mine from Africa. It's unrefined. Um, it is so smooth and it actually helps the economy in, um, for women who are like far, far, women who are the farmers there, or like the, anyway. The, I it's called Maglo Naturals. That's the one I use. My favorite one. So check them out. It helps out their economy, um, and I love the product. It's a great product. It's a really great product. So just go to my website, though. Link in the bio, rockmercury.com. Um, May May says, hey, I'm new here. Hello, good to see you. Thanks for being here. Um, bro looks like an Indian emoji. Um, what is that even? Like, what are you talking about? Um, Jay said, you're so peaceful. Living my life. Oh, that one's not, that part's not good. You can tell the difference between when it's not good and good. Okay, I'm still cutting this open, y'all. Still going to. I don't know how that guy opened it so easily on the video. It's like, it's like how did it's so, sometimes sometimes I watch I watch tutorials or recipes and it does not work as easily as that for me. I really be trying too. Um, do you know what bread food is? Yeah, I do know what bread food is. Um, Lance says, how does jackfruit taste like? I already answered that. Is it like a mango texture? It's so sweet. No, not mango. Mango is, mango is like way more like juicy, you know, it's not, it's not the same as that. It's more texture, like almost like a meat in a way. Um, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me find out where you guys are. 
A lot of comments came through. Over a hundred comments came. Um, hold on, y'all. Hold on. Morning, me, Lord. Anyone know? Okay, anyone know of a good shea butter? I already said that. Um, ma um, Mago Naturals is a really good one. You guys can try that one. There's some other really good ones too, but that's I have them on my website, rockmercury.com slash Amazon. Well, not slash Amazon. Just go to Amazon when you go to the website. Doesn't it smell? Nope. Sandra says, good morning from Vie Viejo. Hello, hello. Good morning to you. Let me send a touch more. Um, jack food is good. I've tasted it a couple of times in Uganda. Ooh, Uganda. Is that jack food? It says H uh, HD. Yep. Vance Kevin says, I've never heard of jack food. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Very good. Um, Kratos is from God of War. God of War. Oh, the game God of War. Okay. Um, I've seen that from Kev, um, from Corey Kenshin's page. Corey Kenshin's playing that game. So I've watched him play that. It's a very interesting game. On YouTube. Um, Mama Hollywood says, no, it's jackfruit, not durian. Nope. That's right. Um, Jeski says, hi from Cuba, brother. Hello, hello. Slim Wupo says, make, make Karen in the world. Jim, um, Jivy, Jizzy Ch Chayo says, do you know what bread food is? Yes, I've already answered that. Slim Wupo says, male. Okay. HD says, I didn't know you could eat it raw. I've seen it substituted for pulled pork in vegan dishes. Yeah, but usually they use canned, they use canned jackfruit and it's not as good at all. It's very mushy because anything you can is going to get like a different kind of texture because that's how they... Man, that's how they preserve it by processing it so much that it barely tastes like the real food anymore. Um, Drizzle says, "Morning, me lord, morning." Um, oh, thank you. Yeah, no problem. T Tika Tech de Marie says, "Ever had salt on it?" No, I don't really. I feel I feel like when you put salt on it, that means it's not like high quality. Um, I don't need to add salt to anything like that. Like I just. I have like to eat it natural so I can taste the real texture and the deliciousness of it. That's why I try to get the best quality food. But I feel like salt doesn't work. Rock, did you ever get banned from TikTok? Yes, I have. Um, I've been suspended unrightfully. And um, I have to fight for my way back. But now I'm very careful and I block any, anyone that's a hater immediately. Um, Mama Hollywood says, yeah, jackfruit is in New York is expensive. I bet it's probably like $40 out there. Um... My cookie because your nails are so nice. Thank you. Um, Darren says it looks like a gremlin egg. Huh. Um, the trees baby says you look like you're enjoying the Houston cold, cold snap. Mm hmm. It's really nice. Kevin Schofield said, Do you remember last year with short hair? I do remember. Mm hmm. I'm glad my hair is growing longer. Rock BF says Valerie tasted it for an oddly good. It may be an acquired taste. Mm hmm. Mama said he has a nice hand, right? Oh, thank you. Hi from Cuba, brother. Hello, hello. Um, Rude said, Is that seed? Is the seed pods the only edible part? Yeah. Like, until you boil the, the seeds. Like, but you can't just bite into the seeds, they're very hard. But I'm gonna boil them and see what that is, what that's give, what that's giving, because I never had that before. Um, not like me making it myself. I probably had it in a substitute, like a meat substitute. Um, but I never ate like boiled my own seeds and sit and found out what that tasted like. Ooh, there's a big old pod here. Oh whoa, look at this pod, you guys. That is a big old pod right there. Oh wow, that's huge. That is huge, huge, y'all. Okay, let's see. Let me get into this right now. Um, wow. There it is. There it is right there. That's a seed. And um, that's that pod. That's a, 
That's giant. That is giant right there. Okay. Mmm. Mama said he has nice hands, right? Thank you. <laughs> mm. Shady says, please don't block me because I love you content. But new people join your live and they don't know anything. <laughs> um. Coffee says, hi. Hello, coffee. Mama Hollywood says, dragon food. It's not, but star food can be amazing. Mm-hmm. Entropy says, my girlfriend likes jack food. Mm-hmm. She must be have good taste. Connor says, the yellow jack dragon food is the sweetest. Yeah, I guess. Still all very mild. Dragon food, is a very, dragon food has a very mild taste to it. 1800 2 first says, satisfying to see you eat. Oh, okay. Glad you're enjoying. Um, you a violation says, yeah, yellow dragon fruit ones are the sweet ones. I see. Um, Klong Liv says, is he reading comments from somewhere else? No, I'm reading it from you guys. I'm reading your own comments. I don't hear him. Ooh, crap. Hold on. And Whiskey says, Allah Akbar, in the world? Why are you saying that? Um, Kevin Schofield says, Rock, do you like WWE? Um, I used to when I was younger. I used to like WWF. Back when it was that way. Um, but nowadays, I don't really watch it. I mean, I know it's fake. So, but it's, I mean, I don't, I'm not against it. I think it's kind of funny. It's better than, like, real fighting. Just, like, this is more performative. So, I appreciate that part because I don't like people getting beat up in real life. But, yeah, I mean, I'm not, I don't really watch it. Um, Plant Daddy says, cut it up, bro. Fully enjoy it better. No, I'm fine. Thank you. Latrice says, how do you pick the jackfruit? Well, <laughs> when you find it, you just get it. Because there's only one there when I when I went. So I just grabbed it. But you want it to be looking ripe and um, like darker spots and stuff on the outside. Like you you want it to not just be super, super green. Because that means it's super like raw. Not raw, but like unripened. Um... Dylan, Dylan the Drip says, good morning, y'all. Good morning, good morning. Mama Hollywood says, I wish I can eat some, so I can find some real shea butter. I mean, go to my website, rockmercury.com. I have it on there. Real shea butter. Is that real, real stuff? Um, go to Slay Shea. Mama Hollywood, oh wait, Plant Daddy says, cut the jackfruit, fam. No, I'm not going to. I already said what I'm doing. Kevin Schofield says, Rock, when are we going to get a sister face reveal who knows um plant daddy says stress eight says cut the fruit wrong don't tell me what to do and Amtray Amtreya says like mini like mini yellow peppers hmm yeah, the textures are kind of like a pepper but like a fruit mixed with a pepper hmm pacify says what is that? It's jackfruit. Mama Hollywood says, it's better just to do it by hand. He said the Roxy messes up his knife. Yeah, it does. It's latex. Kevin says, hello, Rockets and Mercurians. Love that intro, Rock. Thank you. I put it on all my videos. <laughs> I'm going to do some merchandise with that on there. Mama Hollywood says, have, have anyone have... Anyone have a shea butter suggestion? Yeah, like I already told you guys. On my website, rockmercury.com. Click on my Amazon store. Deliver right to your house. Mercedes? Mm. Mercedes says, can you eat the seeds? Only when you boil them, apparently. I've never done it, but I'm going to try it. Mama Hollywood says shea butter. Mm-hmm. Miss Kimberly said, does it taste like peaches? Mm, no. No. Mama Hollywood says, imagine it falling on your head off the tree. You out cold, lol. No, you're, if this falls on your head, 
Edith Walking is done. Like, I hope you had a great, beautiful life. Um, I hope things went well for you while you were living, because when this falls on your head, it's just no, there's, there's no surviving that. Like, are you serious? This thing is so heavy. Mm -mm. And it's, it's spiked too. No, it's done for you. I hope you enjoyed your life. There's no way. You ain't coming back from that one. Let's see. Down South General says, you favor Mike Evans. I don't know who that is. Don't know. Kevin Schofield says, give me a bite, Rock. I already gave y'all a bite. Them hands, Lord. Oh, my God. Thank you. Um, Whoso says, no, he don't. LMAO. Okay. <laughs> You just says so sticky. Wear a glove next time. No, I'm good. Is it slimy? Um, no, it's not. I mean, it's not slimy. It's just latexy, um, like real natural latex. Dun X Dun X says it tastes like what it tastes like. It tastes like um, a textured, like I don't know. I don't. I don't know. Like a pepper almost. Or I don't know. It's kind of hard to give a. You have to. You have to really try. You got to go buy it live, but there is a texture to it, like a, like a hearty texture. Like I can see this being sauteed up and um and eaten in, in different ways with sauces like it it um it has its own flavor of sweetness but it does it can be versatile i feel you need barbecue sauce on that <laughs> but that might work you know cameron says i hope this doesn't seem mean at all i just want to do a comb i just want want to do you comb your beard or do you just let it be free i comb it every day um Trento official says morning, morning to you. What comments is he reading? Earlier comments. Um, my seal, silly Patrick says, looks like Robert Downey Jr. in Tropic Thunder LMAO. What are you talking about? Um, I went to your website, Rock. It said, call Rock Mercury. Um, it says, call Rock Mercury. Um, I don't think it says call Rock Mercury. I was supposed to say I have my um my Amazon store on there too. Good morning, good morning. Humble Hustler says he reads every one that he's probably reading some made before you came to the live. Yeah, that's right. And it says the fact that there's literally fur. No, I missed a comment. Hold on. Hold on, y'all. Hold up, hold up. The fact that there's literally fur inside of it, I thought I was deboning a turkey on my own. I thought, <laughs> well, Sherry, Sherry says, what is the tarnation is that? It's jackfruit. Um, you need a machete. <laughs> no, just to cut it off, probably. Do you stand with Ye or, and Kyrie? I stand with both of them. I think they're, they are um, being tried to make examples. They're trying to make examples of them, and I stand with exactly what they said. And what they meant before they apologized. So I stand with them for sure. Kelby Jesus says, any updates on the gym situation? Uh, I'm going to the manager today to talk with them and get my gym membership canceled until they um, ban that person from the gym. What does it smell like? Like bubble gum. It smells really good. Um, can you bench 250? Um... I don't know. I don't bench anything. Suey Patrick says, I'm, I'm just go over my comments like that. Wow. What in the world? Let's get blocked. Kevin Schofield says, Corey Kinchin is the best. I love Corey Kinchin. Just asking a question says, my life, Patrick. What in the world? Dollar said, is it cooked? First time seeing it inside. No, I don't. No, you don't cook it. You just like peel it and it's raw. Where'd you buy it? I bought it from H-E-B. July 7th, 2023. What does that mean? Um, Amy Carlson says, hi from Minnesota. Hello, hello. Um, Dreadhead says, much love from Atlanta. Hey, Atlanta. Um, both Hodel says, are you vegan? I'm sure. Young Bob says, eat um, eat the god dang food. Oh, you're getting blocked. Goodbye. Um, okay. July 7th. Um, are you vegan? Yeah, planted. I um, no. He's not playing with that fruit. That's oh, very good. I'm new here. What are you eating? I'm eating jackfruit. Where did jackfruit come from? Trees, I think. Looks nasty. Um, so do you. 
Um, Zamira says, what, um, what's your ethnicity? I'm American. Humble Photo says, LOL, I thought I was the only one that felt like that. About what? <laughs> Humble Hustler says that he's reading comments from I don't know where. Sorry? From here. Hold on, I'm live. Oh, okay. All right, you later. You oh, hold on a second. I'm going to come out. Hold on. Let me come out. Say bye. Hold on, you guys. Be right back. Be right back, you guys. Hold on, you guys, I'm back. Let me just put this here. Hold up, hold up. Okay. Whew. Okay, I'm back, you guys. Let me just move this a touch up. It looks nasty with your ethnicity. I thought I was the only one I felt like. Oh, right. What you reading? He reading comments from I don't know where. I don't know why I don't know where. Um, from the top, yep. Dollar says, how much does it cost there? $15. Um, Playboy Chauncey says, um, what is bro reading for real? I already said what I'm reading. I'm kind of full, you guys. I'm really like, this is my first thing I'm eating this morning and I'm like actually full. So I think I'm gonna pause this and maybe I'll do a part two of this because this is a lot of jackfruit. <laughs> it's a lot of jackfruit, y'all, so I need to kind of chill. Um, am I missing comments? Probably. Um, all right, let's see. Dreadhead says, I don't see any of the comments he's reading either. Well, they're, they're here. Who is Plant Daddy? I don't know what that means. Um, where are you reading this? Where are you reading because? What are you talking about? Umbo Hustler says, he reads every comment, so he must. He may be reading comments made before you join. That's right. Um, so do it now. So do what does that mean? Um, how does jackfruit taste? Tastes like a nice, sweet, kind of taffy taste texture or taste. I don't. Know. It's a very specific taste, y'all. Very good though. Um, how does um, plant Playboy? says have um i've been he in here for a minute and i don't know what the heck he's reading well i have a lot of I have a lot of comments um humble hustler says he's reading every comment thank you um sean said laughing laughing dude is reading from another page no i'm not humble hustler says hello people commenting so fast he's far behind exactly ranger says good morning rock good morning to you playboy says what's um that's what i was thinking uh-huh He's making up comments in his head. Really? Y'all, this is so foolish. Bro, this chat barely is moving. Um, what are you talking about? Who is he talking to? Because not us. Wow. I want to block this person. I think I'm going to block them. I'm going to wait for a second, though. That was my first thought. It says, Young Bob. Kevin Schofield says, He's slow with the chat. He is catching up. Exactly. Young Bob says, Bro, looking at the camera, thinking of comments. Um, I'm looking at your page thinking of blocking you. That's what I'm looking at. Um, what is Gucci, Merc? Everything's Gucci. Um, all, um, always laid back says he's too dang slow. Okay, I'm going to block you. Goodbye. Blocked. Um, Kevin says always who's, who isn't B. Hold on. I don't know. Who isn't? Be patient. Thank you, Kevin. Um, Young Bob says, who is Cameron? K 
Kevin says it does. Speed it up, fam. Says always laid back. I already blocked that person. Young boy says anybody got Instagram. I got Instagram. Go to my go to my profile page. You'll see my Instagram is linked. Um, Unsano Shun says wow. Yeah, he's catching up. I remember that comment. Good for you. Um, Young Bob is laughing. Um, Playboy Chauncey says ain't nobody said anything about K Yay and Kyrie. Yes, they did. What are you talking about? I'm blocking you. I don't got this person either. Blocked. Goodbye. Um, Kevin Schofield says Andrew Tate is fighting Jake Paul. I wonder. I hope Andrew Tate wins. I hope Andrew Tate destroyed Jake Paul. Um, always laid back says I love four B four B W A's. What does that mean? Mm. Kevin Schofield says Rock. Did you know that Andrew Tate got all the social media platforms deleted? Exactly. You know, I saw that happen and it made me really want to be conscious of how I operate on my platforms and who I allow to be in my pages. Because they will delete you. These people are like crazy with the delete with the um with the censorship. Um because people say he is he's what uh, sending love from Seattle. Hey Seattle. Say, they say misogynist, that's not true. They, he's not misogynist. Um, Mika Dog says, New Year, what did it taste like? It tastes like jackfruit. I don't know. I, I can't really give you an example. You have to, you have to try it yourself, you guys. Got to get the jackfruit. Very sweet. It's a sweetness to me. I like it. Um, very specific taste. Very, very specific taste. I'm just tearing this apart a bit so that it's easier to put away. I think I'm going to put this in the refrigerator. I think I'm going to put it right in the fridge so I can eat a little later. Um... Cause yeah, it needs to be. I need like some more time to eat this. Um, new here. What it's um, MD says he's just gonna leave. He gonna just leave. Okay. Um, he's reading comments from thirty years ago. I'm dead. Oh, this person's already blocked. Um, Tiny for now said jackfruit stinks so bad. No, it doesn't. Um, okay, I think I'm almost at the bottom of this. Let's see. Uh, I think you're mixing it up with Dorian, yeah, for real. D Dib Blow says, um, so how do you store it after opening it? I'm gonna just put it in a plastic bag and put it in the refrigerator because we have a, we have like three refrigerators here. So I'm gonna put it in one of them as I keep eating it today. I'm gonna try to still finish it today, but um yeah, there's a lot of this. So I'm just gonna do my best to get it. Get as much of it gone as I can. Ooh, the little fly. Um, I'm just gonna get as much as I can off of here and throw it away. Ooh, wait, is this today's trash day? I think today's a trash day. I need to go take the trash out. So, yeah, I think today's a trash day. I wonder if they already came. All right, all right, you guys. I'm gonna head out, you guys. I think I need to get this trash can out. Let me check right now. I think it's time for the trash to go out so I'm gonna go and just put that out but thank you guys for rocking with Mercury I will see you all soon on Free Rock Mercury people I'm enjoying this live thank you bro blocking everybody um nope I'm blocking only haters I said, I'm dying over laughter right now. Chills, you guys. He's really reading his comments. Have patience. Yeah, for real. 10,000 likes. Oh, 10,000 likes. Amazing. Thank you. Um, what are the seeds good for? Very good for health. Um, room clean AF. Yep. See you later. Thank you. Bye. First time here. Okay, I'll be back later on, you guys. Maybe I'll eat some more with you guys later on. Rock on, Mercurians. Bye. See you soon. Thank you. I enjoyed you too. Thank you so much. I got to take trash out. Bye.